So this week I'm doing life hacks and beauty hacks and I hope you guys enjoy it and if you do make sure to give it a thumbs up and also if you're new to this channel you can uh, click the subscribe button down below and yeah that's about it I love you guys and bye bye lovers for me I run out of eyeshadow primers all the time and instead of go and buy a new one if you got a concealer you don't use you could just use that as a primer and it works just the same contouring can be such a struggle sometimes so this technique is to just draw like a the shape of a the number three I guess I don't know how to explain it but you see the point and this makes your contouring flawless every time we all do the same mistake where we buy the wrong shade of lipstick and here you can see I have a too bright lipstick so what you're gonna need is a, a black eyeshadow and then you just apply a little bit of the eyeshadow onto the lipstick and mix it together and then you got a darker shade of lipstick and if it gets too dark you can just apply a little bit of the lipstick and then it will become brighter I love this hack. This hack is where you use your lip balm or Vaseline and you put it on where you're gonna spray your perfume and it will last so much longer than it would without. Just amazing. Love this hack. You don't want the green marks around your fingers. So what you're going to do is you're going to take your ring and a clear nail polish and what you're going to do is you're going to put the clear nail polish inside of the ring and that way when it's dry you won't get the green marks on your fingers. So, who has this problem? The headphones. Where they get all tangled. Well, I got a life hack for you. Firstly, I have to get this tangled up. There we go. So, what I usually do is Firstly, put them together like this, and then another time, and then I just make a knot, like so, and my headphones never get tangled, so I would highly suggest doing this. So this is really smart. Okay, this is not cute. So, what I would suggest is making your bed. It's not really a life hack, but it, it will help you feel more accomplished and just more organized, which is a good thing. So, yeah, make your bed look super cute. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, so I don't really know if you can call this a hack, but it is to make your own to-do list in a frame. Um, so what you're gonna need is this frame and you gotta take it, take out <laughs> your picture and uh, also the glass. We don't need that. So that you can just take away. And then you need uh, some kind of paper that you want to have inside of your frame and here I just use a marker to or a, pe a pen to just draw around the frame and then I cut out the paper and I glue this on to the frame thing but no clue what it's called After that I just put back on the silver frame and now you're almost done. So what you're gonna do after is just write whatever you would like actually. You don't need to write to do list or anything but here I'm writing to do. <laughs> And then you just write the things you need to do and then you stick them on and when you're when you have done the things you can just take it off and write new stuff that you need to do and I think this is a really good hack because it can help you get done with stuff because you get more motivated because of like how it is and it's cute and stuff I don't know I just feel like this is a really great hack Hey guys, this last hack is how to make your own green screens and this I was inspired by Gabrielle Marie so if you need some inspiration or need some green screens then you can check out her channel she's amazing and she has helped me so much so what I'm gonna do is I am gonna go to PicMonkey click on design and costume and here I have to write in 1280 times 720 and make it. So this is the size for your screen and in iMovie. And on canvas color you have to choose kind of like the brightest green you can find. So that's around here. And then you click apply and then you go to this butterfly sticker I guess and here you get a lot of different overlays so you can see here there's lots of different overlays and then you can just customize your own green screen you can do some geometric styles you could uh, do a heart so I'm just gonna do a fast one to show you guys how it can look like and we'll go with a black heart. Ooh, scary. And then I can duplicate this overlay and I choose, let's see here, the brightest green and I click on that and the brightest green again and I shrink it a little bit and I try to put the heart as close to the middle as possible and there you go that's one way to make your own green screen so your video will be in here and also here and this is the cutout or overlay that will come and you can also do transitions like you can make transitions uh, you can duplicate this and put it beside it that and that uh, 
transition can be like hearts coming from this way or this way and yeah just play around and see what you can come up with <laughs> 